Hello everybody, welcome. Today, we're going to talk about what literature is. So, let's get the ball rolling. Here, we have this one. Literature, in its broadest sense, is any written work. That is the traditional meaning. And as we can argue here, that written work is more of uh, the manuscripts, the books, but now in this new uh, technological age, we can get to include also these written works, but not in the form of the tangible books, such as what I have here, Kindle, yeah, like other ebooks. Second point. You know, that is because uh, in its etymological uh, explanation, we can get to understand that yeah, that's how this traditional meaning is formed. Well, it came from the Latin literatura or literatura, which refers to writing formed with letters. Uh, although some definitions include a spoken or song text yeah um because if we're gonna delve deeper uh, pre-literate societies have their uh you know literatures also but in original it's more on the oral manner wherein uh it's because of the traditions where they they pass the the values and their cultures through through epics through narratives uh, through dramas so on and so forth we can uh, get to understand that that uh, these these things refer to the oral literature and it can be called as something as the oldest form of uh, literature since it's it's a uh, fault in its uh, nature well i would like to also pinpoint here that more restrictively it is writing that possesses literary uh, merit. But what does literary merit mean? It's about, you know, considering a work with aesthetic value. There should be a beauty in it. However, it's criticized because somehow it is subjective. Like, beauty that the beauty of, or the value of a certain work varies from culture to culture or from person to person but despite those uh, criticisms uh, there's some something that's uh, unifying in uh, in the term literary merit such as uh, emotional complexity originality concerned with the truth and uh you know that something that can endure uh the test of time something that that can stand well literature can be classified according to whether it is fiction uh, a work of imagination or non-fiction based on uh, the real life happen happenings and whether it is poetry or prose. That's it.